Hi, hello. How are you doing? My name is Doug the Spud. Welcome back to everybody's favorite problematic fave. Favorite problematic fave. Dang it. I hope you're doing okay today. <laughs> if you aren't, that's perfectly fine though. Because regardless of how you're feeling today, I'm hoping I can do a little something to make you feel better. Welcome back to fi fire. I've just been playing a lot of Fire Emblem. <laughs> Welcome back to Persona 5. Uh, we be ranting, we be complaining about the problematic aspects of this game. Either way, I hope you guys are doing okay. Last time, uh, we, uh, had some nice conversations between some characters. We, um, broke, uh, patient, Dr. Patient con con Confidentiality. Um, and, uh, now we're gonna go help out our local politician. Which, extremely relevant right now. Help out your local politicians if you help them and if they're helping you in particular. You know? Election day's coming up. This will probably be up in September. Everyone. That you possess free will does not mean you can always do as you please. To make your decisions based simply on loss and gain is to act like a heartless mon machine. The reason so few people care about their fellow man is because we have so few have the energy to do so. We politicians have fallen short of our goal to change society. We need your support now more than ever. That approach isn't going to work yet to get the voters more excited. We're going to completely lose the hearts and minds of the people. Again, we'd like to say is... What? Councilman Masushitina. It's been so long since we last spoke. I wanted to stop by to see how you're doing. Oh, you have a high school volunteer for you, huh? My, times have changed. Do you know about the Kuramato children? Uh, no, and I don't care. Yes, Mr. Yoshida told me. I don't remember. Hmm, that was nearly 20 years ago. I'm impressed that you're so interested in politics. I was a member of the Kuramato children as well. Yoshida and I joined the same year. Made an amazing career change, going from a pro wrestler to a diet member. I was elected easily, but I had no idea what I was doing. I realized I wasn't elected on my own merit when I failed to be re-elected for a second term. That was true for both of us. No. You made a great comeback, though. You're truly an inspiration. As are you, old friend. You're working harder than anyone on the campaign trail. No, oh, there's no need for false praise to impress the boy here. Yoshid is well informed about the inner workings of politics, so I'm sure he'll be a great teacher. However, I suggest you only do as he says and not as he does if you want to become a diet member. Mm -hmm. What might that mean? I'm guessing he doesn't know. You really think you can win the election by being completely honest and making good arguments? You've got to secure votes, or else you'll be forever known as no good Torah. What? Without honesty and good arguments, there can be no political justice. Yeah, it's been a while since I've heard one of your grandiose speeches. Hmm. Doug Coon, was it? Tell me, what about Yoshida drew you in? His message, his speaking skills. It's hard to say. Eh, his message. Doug Coon. You address matters quite directly for a young person. It seems you have been taught well. Right. I intend to teach him everything I know. That's what we agreed on. I feel like my bond with Yoshida is growing deeper. It allows you to ask for large amounts of money. Right. Mm -hmm. I guess that actually is pretty good. By the way, how are things between you and old man Kuramoto? We're still not on speaking terms. There's something I'd like to get your opinion on, so I'll be in touch. Very well. Oh, that reminds me. You may still distress me because of what happened with the missing party funds, but I'm not the one who pointed the finger at you. That's all I'm going to say. Why did he have to mention that? Yeah, my apologies. That's all for today. Well then, I'll see you again. Good job. I can't do his voice, so I'm just... Well now, I'll see you again. Well now, I'll see you again. Good job. Yeah. Well now, I'll see. Well now, I'll. See. Well now, I'll see you again. Hi. Fancy seeing you here. I didn't think we used the same station. Meeting here must be fate. How are you doing? Not bad. I'm sleepy. <laughs> That's my honest answer most of the time. It's funny because Akechi is also the voice actor for. Uh, Hubert in uh, Fire Emblem, so. 
He's a delight to be edgy boys lately. He's also the voice of Prompto in Final Fantasy XV, which, you know, I loved that game. And uh, also the voice of Saray in Tales of Zillia. Uh, no, no, Zestaria. Zestaria, yeah. Some games you might not have heard of, but I absolutely love. Robbie Damon is the voice actor. Love the guy. Super, excuse me, super big fan of him. I'm sleepy. Did you stay up too late? Are you alright? Ah, I do like the response. It's honest, and it keeps the conversation from dragging. I've been getting interviewed a lot lately, so I've been wondering how to answer such questions. I suppose it's best to simply be yourself and say what you think. You've given me much to consider. If it wasn't too much trouble, may I speak with you again sometime? Sure. I just like the idea of, like, you know, Spud's, like, drinking this coffee, and he's just like, How are you feeling? I'm tired. And he's like, Oh, thank you. You know, you're teaching me so much about interviews and everything. <sighs> So I handed a bill over to a convenience store, and they told me that they don't take foreign currency. But what I gave them was a bona fide Japanese banknote. Don't tell me young people these days don't know who Hirobumi Ito is. I shudder to think that these will be the people shouldering Japan's economy. I hope you all know your stuff, so here's a quiz just to make sure. Hey, Doug. Paper money is issued by the Bank of Japan, but who issues the coins? Uh, I want to guess and say... The... Children's Bank? I don't know. June 13th. The government, okay. The government. Exactly. That's right. Unlike paper money, coins are issued by the government. Originally, the government made both coins and paper money. However, with the ability to make as much money as they wanted, the economy fell into chaos. An independent organization, namely the Bank of Japan, has been... Okay. Actually, that kind of makes some sense. Money is stupid, though, and kind of dumb, so, like, maybe actually is smart. I'm kind of surprised. Nice goal. Well, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Knowledge. Coins don't have as much of an effect on the economy or still produced by the government. You simply can't trust a moron to look after your finances. <coughs> the best they can manage is pocket change. Being able to get as much money as you want whenever you want it. I hope the next palace is somewhere awesome like that. I mean, the amount of money that, uh, at least Joker's running around with is kind of crazy. Oh good, you haven't gone home yet. Listen. Najimi sounds looking for you. Could head to the student council room right now. She says there's no report of a lost item and she just wants you to start filling out some paperwork. Who is Najima? <sighs> Makoto Najima san is the class president of Fujin Academy. His student council room is on the third floor next to the library. Got it? <sighs> Why am I running errands for a student? I know she's the principal's favorite or whatever. <laughs> Najima's a girl who keeps following you around, right? What could she want? To the student council room. Oh, hey, they changed to the back, the blackboard uh, wall. Like this game has a lot of attention to detail, which is very nice and stuff. Like I rant about Persona Five a lot, but it's like it's a fun game and stuff. It's just that you know there's some issues that I feel like you know you need to address when you're playing. It's almost the rainy season, but the constant rain bums me out. And I don't want to do anything. What are you talking about? The rainy season is the time to buy limited rainy day goods. In fact, there's a limited time grizzled natto that's sold at Shibuya Station Underground level. Oh, you really know so much about uh, specials. Okay, so it's at Shibuya Station Underground Mall. That's useful. Hmm. Yeah, let's just talk to people. I haven't really been talking to the student body all that much. The student council room is next to the library on the third floor. What did you do? I'm curious because I remember there was like that one girl who was stalking that one guy. So I'm curious to see what they're doing with that. Like she's like using her phone or something. I don't know. I want, I want some of that juicy high school gossip.
I don't know why they have the loading screens for the doors. Although I guess it kind of makes some sense because um, this game was uh, developed for the uh, PS3 originally. And like, so I think like it's just like a holdover from like Hi. the fact that this game is very, uh, um, I don't want to say just like put together, but it's been through like a lot of different uh, iterations. Hmm. I have no business in the administration office. They have no business with me. Hmm. Am I crazy for thinking like that was an event that was going on with some of the students here? Maybe I am. Mm, second day, nope. Maybe I am crazy. Because, like, there are a lot of, like, background events with the students in uh, Persona 3. So, I know that's a thing. Are you Doug? Ah, so you're the ones everyone's been talking about. A person wants to work with you. Don't cause her any trouble, okay? Student council room. This is student council room. What were we called you for? This is rather strange. I just love the fact that we smuggle a cat everywhere. If I could smuggle you, I would, little buddy. Ah. My cat's right back there. Oh, you can see him in the camera. Have a seat. Sister likes sister. The interrogation. Mr. Kamashita and Madarame. Won't you tell me the truth behind the Phantom Thieves incidents? Can't answer that? Oh, of course. There's no way you would admit to such things. Have a listen. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. So you think it's true? We'll be okay if we keep doing this, right? Oh. What could all this mean? We're doing more. We're doing more than the cops. The blackmail, hypnosis. How do you corner someone into making them confess? Won't you tell me how you did it? No idea. Not sure what you mean. Ask the ask the culprits. You want to say that this doesn't prove anything, don't you? I believe that you three are the phantom thieves. Now, what would the police think if they heard my recording? Would it be bad if we're put under police surveillance? There's no telling what'll happen to you, too. If you confess the truth, I don't mind just leaving this between the two of us. You'll tell me, won't you? All cops are bastards. Fuck the twelve. Never read to be silent. That's the same as admitting to it, you know. Go ahead. Ryuji. That idiot. <laughs> Loud as always, but his timing is perfect. I'd like everyone else to hear this as well. Won't you take me to your friends? I guess it can't be helped now. Man, I hate Mondays. <laughs> this is just a really bad Monday. We had a catch you go off on us when I said I was tired. Now all this is happening. Oh. Hmm? Here? Is that girl a friend of yours? What the hell? What's the meaning of this? I had him lead me here. <laughs> Ryuji Sakamoto. On Takamaki. Takamaki. And you're Kitagawa kun, correct? Second year at Kosei High and former pupil of Madarame. I wanted to ask you all about this. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. An extremely similar technique was used for both Kamashita and Madarame while those affected by their acts were just coincidentally meeting up. How could that not raise suspicions? What do you intend to do? Have you come just to say you're going to report us? I bet someone told you to find us. The school can't have ties to criminals after all. And yet they turn a blind eye when it comes to suicide and sexual harassment. Drag their ass on! Those adults are just using you. I feel sorry for you. I know. Huh? That's 
why I would like to verify the justice you speak of. What? I'm the only one who knows about you. If you prove what you're doing is just, I'll erase this. She wants to make a deal. There is someone whose heart I'd like you to change. Who? Hmm. So you're not saying it's impossible. However, I cannot tell you that just yet. Let's continue our talk after school tomorrow. On the roof. Man. Assuming you accept my offer. Turning into a real pain. This is a good el evolution of stakes, though. I like this. You were careless. I don't think you truly understood how high the stakes were. <laughs> <in being able laughs> to He's save stakes. Why are you singling me out? On got recorded too, you know. I'm so sorry. Hey, what should we do? That girl's got dirt on us. A recording seems to be insufficient evidence, though. And even with that, there's no way they could prove our methods. Considering who we're dealing with, I think it might be a trap. Regardless, this guy would be in real trouble. He's on probation, after all. Things would get rough if we didn't have our leader. And I totally don't want to deal with the police. Then, we have no other choice but to go along with it. Yes, it's best we agree. At least for the time being. We made a crucial mistake, but not a critical one. We'll just have to recover from here on out. Yeah, yeah. My bad. So, we doing this? If everyone wants to. Alright, we're meeting on the school rooftop tomorrow, yeah? What about me? I could always sneak in if necessary. That'll draw too much attention. You should just wait outside, Yusuke. What could she be scheming? It's a rainy season. This would be a great time to go to mementos if I... If I didn't already do everything. I'm so effing pissed! Do we just gotta do what she says? Considering what has happened, it seems we have no other choice. I wonder whose heart the student council president would want to change. Don't matter to me, but there might be a reason behind who she picks, right? Let's turn her down, I don't care. I wonder who it is. I am curious myself. She mentioned how she wants us to prove our justice, did she not? Yeah, she definitely did. Then there must be some reasoning behind your choice. Please contact me immediately if you find anything out. And don't go picking any fights, okay, Ryuji? Why are you singling me out? I ain't dumb. Katie. Look, I'm taking this cat now. Hey! Be careful. She's a shrewd run. We best prepare for anything. It's still Monday night. We're at about 18 minutes, so. Let's. Ah! Morgana! Morgana, please. I hate this. It is so bad. Like. I. I heard, like, they fixed this in Royal because, like, this is. From a purely mechanical gameplay standpoint, this is probably my biggest complaint is that, like, there's no reason why we can't go out and do these little things. And that would really smooth over the fact that, you know, you have so much, like, stats you need to grind. Like, yeah, so it's like, uh... How do I... Where is my, uh... Oh yeah, there we go. Social stats. Like, you have to grind all all these. So, like, if I could just go and do something, or if I could at least do my, like, basic stuff in here, I think that would really make it easier. <sighs> okay. Honestly, I think this would be a good spot to call it, actually. It's a little short. Yeah, let's do it. Um, a little shorter episode, but, you know, usually we go to bed and then stuff happens right as we wake up, so we're not given any chance. So this seems like a pretty good spot to call it. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a good time. Regardless of how you were feeling today, I hope you're feeling a little better after being here. But please, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. 
Remember Black Lives Matter, and I am happier here, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.